Welcome back to Coffee at the Continental. Doug Side and Jeff Comstock. And we are from InCentervilleIowa.com. Local people, local places, free classifieds. <laughs> We're a little silly this morning. Uh, some pretty rough weather out there, I'll tell you. Not too good for the fair, huh? Mm. Kind of sad. Well, we don't have a guest today, but we're going to go over a few things. Now, the big news going around town was released Friday in the newspaper. Morgan Klein has bought the Majestic. So, pretty excited. There's going to be some good things happening with that place. Uh, you know, he, he, he and Bill Birch are responsible for a lot of the things around town, uh, historic buildings that have been renovated. And I believe I... I don't actually want to get into it and what it's going to be used for, anything like that, because I only read the article in the newspaper. So we'll talk to Bill when he gets back from Hawaii, and I actually I believe he's going to do a show. So we can actually get it right from the horse's mouth and know a little bit more about it. And we won't have that uh, uncertain, uncertainty, because you never really know. When the newspaper writes something, you never I mean, you know. I mean, it's, it's the right news, but I think we can get a little more news, maybe. maybe. Maybe, maybe not. Maybe that's all there was to say. I guess we'll find out. Well, my parents have arrived. And I've got a little footage of them coming down the escalator at Des Moines uh, Airport. Why don't we roll that, Jeff? We'll roll that for fun. You can see Mom and Dad coming in. They look pretty good, huh? Yeah. Yeah, not too bad. Not too bad. And uh, they got off the plane all right. Everybody saw they didn't fall down the escalator, so that's good. And uh, they're going to be here through Wednesday, and hopefully we'll have them on the show tomorrow. Now, it is raining a little bit outside, but we know not just a little bit, but not a little. We're having some pretty stormy weather, so hopefully they're going to still get out and be able to do some things here in Centerville, and they'll have something to talk about with them <laughs> other than baby pictures of me or what I did when I was three or something embarrassing like that. <laughs> Centerville wants to know about we had Malia's fourth birthday party yesterday. Now, she doesn't turn four until Tuesday on the 20th. And you've probably seen the videos I released from Children's Art Festival. It was kind of a new take on uh, reporting an event because I didn't want to miss the event and I didn't want to miss taking Malia to the event because that's like a real cool father-daughter thing to do. So, uh, you've probably seen her in the videos and we had a great time. It was a real cool way to shoot and I wish we could have done more, but the, the videos I have are basically what Malia wanted to do, and that's pretty much all she wanted to do, so that's what we did. It was her day. Uh, so it wasn't really about recording the event as much as it was about her. So, And we had a great time at the birthday party yesterday. Sorry you couldn't be there, Jeff. Rough weekend, I know, but these things happen. All right, so we've got some sound issues that we're aware of, and we actually had some issues with the show on Friday, unfortunately, with our first guest, Jim DiPrizio. And we are going to continue, just, we'll continue working on that. We're hopefully going to get our sound a little better for you, and we'll let you know as, as we know. And you've probably already noticed that we're not shooting in the same location today. We are in the Continental, but we're in the dining room. The light that pro that's provided by the front window uh, is absent today because of the rain clouds. So we found some light to shoot in. And that's so here we are in front of the beautiful Continental Hotel. We're, we're, we're sitting in front of the hotel. Okay, maybe not. <laughs> All right, tonight the fair starts, I believe. I don't know, they had something going on yesterday. It, was, it said the 18th something. I don't know what they were doing yesterday there, but there was something. And I apologize for not actually knowing. Uh, what was going on there, but tonight is the fair dedication at 7 o'clock, so you don't, don't want to miss that. And that's when things kind of get started. And they're going to have the 4-H fair, mom and dads, I guess. And they'll also uh, introduce the fair queen contestants. At 7.30, the Bill Riley Talent Show will start. That's sponsored by Iowa Savings and Trust. And uh, I believe that show goes on throughout the fair. You can see it at different times on different days. And it's in the fair program. So just get yourself a program when you get there and check that out because I've heard that's uh, really awesome. Also, the crowning of the queen will be tomorrow night and then fireworks after. So we'll be out there shooting footage and hopefully get an interview with the queen 
And if you see us out there, get on camera. Say, hey, Centerville, or hi, Mom, like we like to say, right, on camera. Well, that's about it that's going on. Uh, we're looking forward to a exciting week. We are going to have, I believe, we will have an interview with Amanda Massey from Little White Y and Tuesday night. So it might be something I'm able to release on Wednesday on the website, or maybe even later Tuesday night. And we want to get that up quick because we're going to talk about their performance at the fair. They're performing on Thursday and Saturday, I believe. So we want to get that up to promote the show. Now we're also going to interview the whole band after the Thursday night performance. So we'll be out there again doing stuff. So big week at the fair. Anything else you'd like to add on the show today, Jeff? Um, I just I would just like to uh, make sure to tell everyone in Centerville be safe out be safe out there. If there's water flowing into the area where you're about to drive into, turn around. Turn around. Those are good good words. Turn around. Don't turn, drown. Don't, don't, turn around. Don't drown. Well, Jeffrey, thank you. Yeah, and uh, those are words to live by over the next couple days. Keep your eyes open. A lot of flooding and a lot of rain. So we'll all be here. Weathering the storm. Is that how they say it? Weathering, I'm weathering the storm? I don't know. I don't know either. All right, Sirenville, that's it for the show today. Thank you so much for watching. We'll be back with the show close in just a minute. And now, a word from our sponsor.